if we want to integrate this, first we have to think about the, the rule, which is not on your form. If you have the integral of x to the nth dx, okay, there always is a dx because you're integrating respects to x. Um, basically, uh, the answer is with when you derived, you subtracted the power and multiplied by it. Here, instead of subtracting, what's the opposite of subtract is to add. And what's the opposite of multiply by the power? Divide. And then you put a plus C. That is the most important integral around. And it's not on your sheet. OK. So that's something you need to know. Now, to do this, by the way, you always have an integral sign. You always have a dx or dy or something, depending on the letters inside. That means to integrate. First thing we want to do is distribute. So we now have x to the third plus 3x dx. OK? From there, to integrate this, Basically, you integrate each piece. You could write this out. It's kind of not necessary, but you're technically doing this. I'm writing it for the sake of technicalities. Are we okay with that? That's technically what you're doing right now. You separate it, pull out your GCS. Now, so according to my rule here, what do we do with x to the third? Well, we add a power which would be x to the fourth, and you divide by four. Are we okay? Plus c. Now, you're not going to write plus c every time in the future. But for this particular one, are you okay? For the second one, well, leave the three, correct? And what's the derivative of x? Well, isn't x x to the first? So x to the first, wouldn't that be, you could have put a 1 there? So what's 1 plus 1? Isn't that 2? And then do you divide by, divide by that? Plus c? Now, it, what's a constant that you don't know plus a constant that you don't know? Isn't it a, a constant in itself? Can I just put those together and just put c still? Do I need to put plus C every time? No, because it's a constant. It Just put it all together in the end, it doesn't matter. So basically my answer is x plus 4 over 4 plus 3x squared over 2 plus C. You do not have to worry about putting your fractions together. Hallelujah. You are done. Okay. The next one. For this one, it's not a polynomial. So my first step would be to rewrite this as I'm going to first distribute the squared in. So 3x squared is 9x and x squared is x squared. Now still, it's not very pretty. I want to change this to 1 9th Sorry, with the integral, take the 1 ninth out. And can I make that x 1 over x squared? Wouldn't that be x squared to the x to the negative second? Are you guys okay with that? 1 over x squared is x to the negative second, and I brought the 1 ninth and took it out. It's a constant. Okay, so let's integrate this. Well, the 1 ninth stays out front. And then add 1 to this is, well, when you add 1, isn't it x to the negative first? And then you divide by the negative 1 plus a c. And we're done. Just simplify it down. The key is you first have to change it to be more accessible and reasonable. So my answer looks like it's going to be 1, or can I put negative 1? Bring the negative just up. And this is going to be a 9. And where's the x going to be? On the bottom, because of the power. 
plus C.